Now, Channel 3 Early Warning Weather with Melissa Cole. All right, good morning, everybody. 6.15, a lot to talk about for the weather over the next several days, so let's get right to it. Um, here's what's going on on our weather headlines. We have a foggy start out there. In fact, we have a dense fog advisory for New Haven, Middlesex, and New London County until 10 a.m. this morning. And where it is below freezing, we're also watching out for some icy spots. So just be mindful of all of that as you travel out early this morning. You may want to wait a few hours, maybe hold off your trip a little bit. Um, again, the icy spots where it's below freezing and the fog is dense in spots, reducing the visibility just about everywhere across the state. We're also forecasting showers today, especially midday into the afternoon, and then two chances for snow in the upcoming week, Monday, and then again, Wednesday into Thursday. So very busy in terms of the pattern for the next few days. Here's a look right now at Live Early Warning Pinpoint Doppler. We're scanning dry, so no showers out there just yet, but they're developing just down to our south, and they're going to be here um, by midday today. Right now in Willington, 31 degrees. Winstead, 30. West Hartford, right at the freezing mark at 32. New Haven, 36. So again, where we're at or below freezing, we're watching out for icy spots. Not much of a wind out there, so no wind chill factor to deal with early today. Here's our iCam in Hartford. The visibility has actually gotten worse since we've been on the air this morning. Uh, not much to see at all from this vantage point. 35 degrees, light winds out of the northeast. And right now in Unionville, Sue has 32 degrees at her house. Phil in Higginham has 33 and Eleanor in Hampton has 35 degrees. Here's a look right now at our satellite and radar picture and you can see that we have clouds across the area and the showers are not too far away. They are developing down to our south and are actually going to be picking up in intensity and streaming northward as a warm front kind of lifts north across the area. So I do think by lunchtime today, we have a good chance for seeing some showers, especially in parts of central and eastern Connecticut. Western Connecticut, you may not get in on much of the heavy rain action today, but still showers a possibility. So this is noontime, and notice what happens by 2, 3 o'clock. Some heavy periods of rain here in central and eastern Connecticut, right along the Rhode Island border. Then by 5, 6 o'clock tonight, the heaviest rain has lifted northward. We're still left with some lingering showers, and that may continue throughout the evening hours. Mainly dry overnight a spot shower certainly possible the clouds stick around when you wake up tomorrow morning we'll still have the clouds kind of socked in but I do think as the day progresses tomorrow sunshine will break out from the clouds and depending on how much sunshine we see will really play a role in our temperatures tomorrow right now we're forecasting a high of about 57 but if we see enough sunshine some towns could actually hit that 60 degree mark believe it or not and then we're talking about snow on Monday so temperatures drop pretty quickly Sunday night into Monday morning. Then by noontime, the storm system is going to mainly pass to our south, but we're just on the northern fringe. So I do think we could have a few hours of accumulating snow between about noon and four on Monday. That could amount to a couple, perhaps several inches. We're going to fine tune things today, but be mindful of that for Monday. Then we get a break on Tuesday. Then on Wednesday, we start out the day cloudy, and here comes the snow from our next storm system, which actually looks stronger. So this could be quite a long period of some accumulating snow Wednesday night, Thursday morning into Thursday afternoon before things wind down on Thursday evening. So this again could be some significant snowfall and we will certainly be looking at it closely and passing along more information as we get it into the forecast center. So temperatures today will be climbing into the 40s to near 50 degrees as some warmer air kind of streams up from the south, but it may take a while. And then for tomorrow, we're forecasting sunshine and temperatures well into the 50s. And then as we head towards Monday, here comes that period of snow in the afternoon um, on Tuesday, a break, but a cold day. And then Wednesday and Thursday, more snow possible before um, coming down Thursday night. And then Friday looks sunny and cold with highs in the 30s.